what is up you guys welcome to seth leroy hustle adventures we are on to the next so now just getting some gas gonna fill her up now i'm gonna go to uh somewhere it's still up in the air like they were gonna give me one but then another driver had it and yeah so whatever um so let's just let's just get rolling we're gonna go on another adventure uh and we'll see if we get one tonight today or for in the morning and i'll keep you guys posted but for now let's get on the road what's up you guys so far we haven't found a run so i'm just setting up shop getting my bed ready but i wanted to show you guys this comfy smushy bed and then under it i got my daughter's gym mat i showed in a different vlog and then i got just a regular box um one of those crate ones and you just put it sideways and it's the perfect level to make my bed i stay so warm in my mummy sleeping bag right there and uh People say like, yeah, you can put heaters in here, but like, dude, I stayed in below with windshield in Minnesota. It was below like 20. And I, that night I fully wrapped up in my mummy sleeping bag and I literally was like, fine. There'll be a link in the description of the mummy sleeping bag, but like, I like, my legs are hot at night. Like I usually just put it over my legs and waist and I got a thermal on under here, thermal jeans, but I'm fine with it. I'm comfy, dude. I, I don't even care to get the diesel heater yet. I mean, I've stayed in super, super cold, so I don't know when I would need it. But anyways, I'm still on call. Oh, he's typing right now. So, and I'm all like mid set up. But yeah, I said I'm down for whatever, anything comes out. Let me know, he's typing right now. So I guess we'll see what happens. Maybe I could just like lay down just so at least my body is laid down. Oh, someone just pulled in here. All right. Well, let's see what he says right now. Okay, so anyways, yeah. I'll get back to you guys in the morning or if I get a run tonight, we'll see what happens what is up you guys i am at the gas station gonna i'm getting some gas it's gonna be a good day it is friday so it is a big day it is the day where you want to get something before the weekend and you get a long run before the weekend starts so that you can be rolling through the weekend because i want to be out for like i had monday i had to get my twic card that's a card so you can go into you know more secured areas and certain areas need that and that's a thing you fill out and whatnot and that's a good thing to get mine was like 135 bucks uh it comes in the mail after like a month after you're approved and stuff with the background check but all of my stuff that i have my felonies are really old they're like nine years old yeah something like that but anyways so go for your twit card because i guess it's good and it'll pay for itself once you get them because you get a little bit higher bucks because of that but anyways so that's all. the reason i brought that up is because monday i had to do that at 2 30 p.m so that sort of screwed up my start of the week and then i still had three run offers for the next day so yeah or for that day i ended up getting one that evening and that's what happened so like i would be doing even better by now but it's whatever so hopefully this today we get one um I had one every day so far but just uh, one for over the weekend but anyways we'll see what happens i'm gonna get gas i'm gonna go get my coffee to start my day and just chill out until we see what happens what's up you guys the sun is coming up I've just been chillaxing. Um, the runs are going to start popping. Look, they still got Christmas lights. What a nice dog park. It's got like things they can go on. Check out these dogs, bro. I mean, come on, bro. Come on, dog. We got puppies here, bro. Like, what's going on? Let's go. Let's see this puppy. 
That's what I mean, on the road, seeing stuff. You gotta see these puppies. I'll keep you guys posted, let's go. Okay guys, so I got one coming from Kansas to Ohio, so closer to my home, and then I wanna look for one for East Coast or something, cause I'm gonna stay out like a week and a half, that's my goal, but we'll see how everything goes. You guys know how it goes, it's all random. But, <coughs> had a guy at the gas station, he's like, oh, do you got jumper cables? Could you jump me? And I'm all like, yeah, dude. And then he tries to get in, and I say, no, I got all this stuff, like, sorry, you can't get in. And two, like, with I have uh, four kids and a wife, like, and I, I listen to murder shows, and, like, I'm not, and he's got foam on the side of his mouth, and I, like I said, I'm eight years sober. I know how that lifestyle is. I could tell what was going on. And then, so he's just like, no, man, please, like, I was like, I was going to jump you. I thought you were pointing, like, in the parking lot, you know, like, and then he goes, no, no, I'm down the road five minutes. And I'm like, well... I, I can't, like, I can't do that. I just got a load. And uh, then he started asking, well, can I get in the back? And he like started walking like back to the back of my van. And I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Cause he was, I had the window open and I was like, no, 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 you can't, like, you know, you can't get in the back of my van. Like, this is my business. Like I can't get pulled over with a human being in, in the, in the back. Like, <laughs> and then he was like, no, don't leave. Like, I'm gonna ask this guy and just don't leave because if not, I gotta get in the back. And I was like, nope. So I started pulling off and like, then he like looked at me and went like, stop, you know? And then I waved by, cause like, trust me, I've been in bad situations, but for one, there's no room here. For two, you can't ride in the back. I'm for general freight. I can't have a human, but I just thought I'd tell you guys, that was pretty crazy. And he was being, he started like holding onto my windshield, like at first when I said, dude, I can't and put it in drive, like, cause I could tell it, it was getting weird. You know what I mean? People rob people, you know, I've been in that lifestyle. I know the game. It can be a trick to be like, he, trust me. I, so anyways, I'm excited that I got one going to Ohio cause the Midwest is where it's at with money. But, uh, yeah, so I'm heading out to go pick it up. I drove down the street just to park a second. GPS my new one uh, this one's for 700 and this one's for where is it 710 um, so that's 75 cents per mile but that's usually just getting out of a bad place you don't go super high so anyways I'm gonna start riding out that was crazy just thought I'd update you guys on that and I've had a couple times I've like helped a guy you know giving him gas money you know uh, stuff like that and I help people but that was I was like dude I could have jumped you if you were here but I'm not gonna like do this weird like you riding in my fucking back of my van but anyways let's get rolling hope that guy figures it out Okay, we are all loaded up. <clears throat> Time to go to Columbus, Ohio. It was, they said two pallets, but it was one pallet, which is cool. I'm sure some of you know if you do this. I always, now I've been strapping front and back, so that thing don't move. I got my straps all set perfect. Let's get on the road. Wait, 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 did I say how much this one was for? I think I said 710 at first, but found out it's for 760, which is 80 cents. But that's always like when you're just trying to get out of a dead zone from what I'm learning are not as busy of a zone. Now I'm going to Ohio, which is a better zone. So anyways, let's get on the road. All unloaded so that one I don't know if I said the price of this one I might have this one was 760 so it was like 80 80 cents a mile yep 80 cents a mile um but anyways uh, I'll, I'll get back to you guys once I you know get ready to rest and stuff um, like once I get my bed ready, because this was good that I could drop it off tonight. They wanted direct, but sometimes that direct, they just want you to get close and then deliver it ASAP in the morning. But luckily this one was direct and now I get to, it's, 
so 2 30 in the morning which i'm fine with because now i'm gonna go to sleep wake up at 11 look for a load um like i said this is my long week or long part of the week the month that's what i'm gonna do at the beginning of the month i'm trying it this way for about seven to ten days being out and then the rest of the month will be all local regional so we'll see how it goes and if that doesn't work we'll keep adjusting our plan but anyways uh i'll get back to you guys when i'm all well actually no i'm just gonna close it out right now thanks for watching seth leroy hustle adventures um because after this i'm gonna go to bed um and you guys have seen me go to bed enough but keep hustling keep striving for any goals that you want to get to um yeah so i'm just gonna get to a truck stop or i mean a rest area go to sleep and then i'll get back at you guys in the morning but that'll be a separate vlog we'll see if we get a good one but anyways like share subscribe hit the bell notification if you want to have a good day